18 News Now. The time is 10 p.m. Thank you for joining us for LEX 18 News Now. I'm Nancy Cox. A Blackburn escapee has been captured in Louisville. 30-year-old Brandon Edwards walked away from the minimum security complex around 7.15 last night. Corrections officers tracked him down in Louisville this afternoon and booked him into jail there. Edwards was convicted on burglary and theft charges in Breckenridge County and was serving 10 years when he escaped. Investigators tell us a semi-truck took a curve too fast and crashed in Scott County this afternoon. This was the scene on Mallard Point Drive just off US 25. Deputies say no one was hurt and nothing spilled when the truck overturned. That scene was cleared up about 4 this afternoon. A mother died after an apartment fire in Louisville Tuesday night. Firefighters rescued four people from an apartment building in the Lake Dreamland area. 41-year-old Archimeda Riley died after being taken to the hospital. The cause of the fire is under investigation. Be sure to join us here in a little bit for LEX 18 News at 11. We'll have the latest about the first court appearance for ex-fugitive Eric Kahn after his arrest in Honduras earlier this week. Your LEX 18 Storm Tracker weather forecast is coming up after this. Ageless medical weight loss can help improve your overall health. Robert lost 107 pounds and 83 inches. He reduced his cholesterol and triglycerides levels. Ageless is a safe, affordable, medically supervised weight loss solution. Call today for a free consultation. Well, thank you for leaving your pictures of dinner and cat videos and coming over to our little corner of the Internet here. So what we're talking about, well, starting tomorrow, a little taste of the Arctic. It's not a, a huge blast of tell your grandkids kind of cold, but you know, a nasty little shot for early December. Saturday, there's a clipper coming down that could give us a little taste of the snow. You may see some snowflakes flying. Chances of anything accumulating are not particularly high. Next week, that may be a little different story. Nature comes back for a second, maybe even a third helping, not only of the cold, but snow potential as well. Here at 10 o'clock, we have hit the freezing point in Lexington and Mount Sterling. Flemingsburg's down to 31. Danville's at freezing. You notice London and Jackson, Williamsburg, all a little milder. There's been a cloud deck that's just hung pretty tough, and temperatures there have moved very little throughout the day. There is your Arctic front. As we get you into tomorrow morning, clouds associated with it. Winds will turn northwesterly, and with that, we will see temperatures holding pretty steady. In fact, may try and fall a couple of degrees late in the afternoon. Could we see a flurry on the front? perhaps, but it's not a huge chance. Our clipper in question is what's dropping down out of Canada. We roll into Friday morning. We will see that little tiny warm front try and scooch by. So Saturday's temperatures may actually rise a couple of degrees, but not many. And then the next chilly surge comes southward for Sunday. Now, what about snow chances? So we take it 830 Saturday morning. There's snow up there along the lakes with the clipper. We work our way then into Saturday afternoon and you see that dark gray shade. Okay, that's saying the model is going to get like you know, stuff may be falling, but it's, it's not going to be a big deal. Uh, we continue into Sunday morning. That heads over toward, say, Snowshoe in West Virginia and away. Next clipper drops southward Monday night and Tuesday. Maybe just warm enough when it starts a little bit of a mix, and then as the colder air pours in again on Tuesday, you'll see a little bit better coverage of some snow showers or flurries. And another clipper dives in right behind Wednesday. That one may be a little bit more significant. You going to be in Danville tomorrow morning? If you are. Tune on over to WKYB 107.5 B Country. I'll be on there with Larry Vaught and talking more than just cat's paws. We're going to be talking some weather tomorrow morning. It starts around 9.20, 9.30-ish. Upper 20s tonight, upper 30s tomorrow. We'll talk in great detail through the next eight days over on TV. Come over here at 11. Great selection, dependable service, and a competitive price. We understand, and that's what we bring you every single day. We know we have to work hard to earn your business, so we will. P-Rats, because bigger isn't better. Better is better.